Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video, we're going to be going over the new update for Atlantean City. Now, as many of you know, a new Lumion was added, a new Mysterious Lumion. Um, at the moment, I currently have no idea what that is. Um, I'm looking forward into investigating as to what it is. But with the addition of this new Lumion, we have new arcade things over here, such as Dodgy Dobo. At the moment, we're still waiting for these two, but in the current meantime, we have Dodgy Dobo. Now, if you guys don't know what this is, this is basically just the revamp version of Flappy Bird, but in Lumion Legacy. And we've been getting a lot of questions in regards to what's the prize? How do I beat this? Why is this so hard necessarily? Well, to be honest, it's really not that hard. It's pretty self-explanatory. You just click, uh, you can hit the top like so, like that. Um, but if you do something like this, I believe you die. Yeah, so if you touch the roof, you're fine. If you touch the bottom, you're dead. Note that. Tip number one. So a lot of you have been complaining, uh, probably uh, as to these parts, why is it so hard? A little tip I have for you guys is when the stones or whatever they are, the pointy things, align in the middle, just click normally. When they're really high up, try to first start off really low, like this, then get up. Personally, I find it to be more easier Though, although it's at a point where it's like a risky move, you have the less likelihood of you bumping your head over here. And in addition to this, every 20 points you score enables a new map. Keep that in mind. So as so, we have a middle and we have a downward stoop. So for the downward part, what you would want to do is drop really low. Not like that low where you die, uh, but drop no uh really low to the point where you're practically on the edge of touching the floor but not really close like so by doing this it'll feel just as normal and personally i find it to be the easiest trick to getting around this stay pretty close to the stone while either staying really high up or really low and necessarily doing this will get you the mount more faster and for a quick display, here is what the mount looks like. This thing is insane. I'm riding a giant chicken. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys want to, you know, comment down. Uh, if you need help, I can always do more tutorials like these. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned uh, for more videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay safe. Peace.